Hey everyone, got some wonderful news. I have just arrived in Mesquite, Texas at the Convention Center for the Lone Star Regional, and I'm hoping to show you some exclusive footage of some beautiful clocks that are there. Uh, they're gonna have a Black Forest exhibit, which I'm excited to see because I love cuckoo clocks. And so we're gonna go check this out. The doors are opening in about a half hour or so, and I am super uh, excited to see this and share it with you. So I'm at the Mart right now, and there are so many clocks on display here for sale. Uh, there's some that are in pristine condition. There's others that need some work. There's definitely some project clocks here. But wow, the amounts of clocks and the range of the different kinds of clocks here is just phenomenal. Uh, I love these swinger clocks that you see right here. These are some of my favorites. Um, all the different figures that they have. It's, these are just some of my favorite clocks. Uh, there's lots of other figure clocks here as well. I ended up purchasing a couple because they were really, really good buy. Um, but to get access to this event, I want to point out that you need to be a member of the NAWCC and uh, you can go to their website. I've got it listed below and in the description because this gets you access uh, to these special regional events which happen throughout the year as well as the national that's in Pennsylvania this year. And the amount of wisdom and knowledge contained in this organization uh, in regards to clocks is just phenomenal. And you're gonna meet a lot of wonderful people. So I encourage you to check out the NAWCC and find out where your local chapter is meeting Hey everyone, I am outside the convention center and I found some great deals on clocks and meeting a lot of friendly clock enthusiasts here. So this is just a great place to be. If you haven't been to a regional yet, I recommend checking out and see when the next one's coming because you can meet some terrific people and find some great deals on clocks. Click it or ticket. Well, it is closing time here. It's been super great to be here, and I'm excited to come back tomorrow and show you more. Hey guys, you never know what's gonna happen. I'm in the hotel room at the convention center. The power is out, but at this convention, they gave me a pin with a light. And I have to tell you, this is probably one of the best gifts, uh, especially for this time with the power being out. So thank you, NAWCC. Now I need to see if I can take a shower with this thing and get ready for bed. Hey guys, I am at the Lone Star Regional and this is the giant cuckoo clock named Rudy on display here. As you can see, this thing is massive. This is a gorgeous clock, and there's kind of a neat story uh, behind it. But just look at the size of this and the carvings. This is a monumental clock, and it's been a privilege to see this and share this with you today.
Hey guys, I found a project clock for myself. Here it is. Uh, I don't know if you remember your Bible stories from Sunday school, but here is Ruth from the Bible. You can see that there. Anyways, uh, she's holding some sheaves of grain. And uh, this is definitely a project. Hopefully, I can get it going. Uh, that might make for a fun video restoring this case, but absolutely enjoying uh, myself at the Lone Star Regional. guys I am in the parking lot and I'm out of packing material but I did have these doggy bags for our dachshund when we take him places we pick up his poop anyways um, I am going to blow these up and make a little bit extra packing material just now thought of that so that can be a good clock tip if you are a dog owner and you don't have enough packing material Use a doggy bag, but just don't use one that already has doggy doo-doo in it, because that would be gross. There we go. This will help keep my clocks from banging into each other. So yeah, I'll let you know if this works. Hopefully it will last the six hour drive home. for joining me on my journey here at the Lone Star Regional. Let me know in the comments below if this is something you'd like to see more of. Uh, I can try to do that, but uh, it's just been so much fun uh, to see all these amazing clocks and meet some terrific people. And just wanted to bring some of that to you. And uh, thanks for watching my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, consider subscribing and give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Thank you.